adventurers and welcome to another Q&A video. Rebecca Levine wants to know how do I carry money when I travel, especially if I'm going from country to country and currencies are changing. I usually bring some American money with me because a lot of countries accept American currency and that's usually just maybe so I can get a drink at the airport or when I'm waiting for a flight. I also use that money for when I first arrive in a new country so I can get from the airport to my accommodations using local transportation. I try not to exchange at the airport unless I absolutely have to because the rates tend to be really high. So once I've settled into my new accommodations, one of the first things I do is find out where the closest bank is. Then I will just use my debit card to take out money because the exchange rate is the best when you use the debit card. I think I get charged about $5 for every transaction that I make when I use my debit card. Because of that, I try to take out enough money that I'll need for about a week. Sometimes I've done more, but I also don't want to have too much money on me just in case anything happens. Where do I put my money? I am one of those people that use this, but not all the time. I don't always have it around my waist everywhere I go, but I will use it occasionally such, on, such as on overnight train rides or bus rides just so I can have my money close to my body. Again, I don't take out a lot of money and just have it on me. I take out as much as I think I'm going to need for food and water and just like basic necessities. If I'm going planning on doing an activity, then I will go and take out money for that activity because I don't like to have a bunch of money on me. I don't want to be a target and because that would be the worst thing to have all this money on you and then you get robbed and then you have to cut your travel short because you lost all this money. When I do take out money, I hide it in different places. I don't keep it all together. And I think some of you might have seen these guys before. These are my travel jeans, which I made. I painted. Here, have a look. Got the Taj Mahal. And there's a backpack. Ha! Hopscotch globe. And we got Wall of China. And do, do, do. we got Passport Canada. Then we got the Coliseum. And oh, the CN Tower. Got to represent Toronto. These are my travel jeans. And I'm actually working on setting up a shop for Hopscotch the Globe where I can um, sell stuff that I've made or stuff that I really enjoy and use on a regular basis when I travel. So these guys will be one of the things that I'm going to be selling. And inside the pant leg, one of the pant legs, which one is it? I think, ah, there we go. I have a little pocket that I put in here. Let me, let me just, give me a second. There we go. So inside, there's a little pocket that I have in here. And I can put some money in there secretly. No one will ever know, except you guys now. I hope that answers your question, Rebecca. And if you have any further questions that have to do with currency or any travel related question at all, leave it in the comment box below and I will answer it in an upcoming video. I lost track of what I was gonna say for a second. Video, video. Moving on. Wait, don't go anywhere yet. I also answered another question this week. Right here. Check it out. Goodbye.